guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how to make your own liquid chalk. So what you will need is loose gym chalk, some rubbing alcohol, this is 70%, a funnel, and a blender. Okay, so we're going to set this up and I'm going to show you guys exactly how to make it. Okay, so I'm going to dump in the alcohol. This one's about uh, half full. Empty that in there, and you're just going to use this container to put the liquid chalk in so you can just use that to disperse it onto your hands. So now for the chalk. Just add a little bit of chalk in there, loose chalk, and then you're going to blend it. And you can play with the consistency if you want it a little uh, more or less thick, you just gotta mess with it. Add some more alcohol or more chalk, depending on how thick you want it. And there you have it. That's liquid chalk for you guys. So just go ahead and use the funnel. This is just the easiest way to do it. And pour it in the bottle. Obviously, you want to give that a good cleaning um, or get a spatula and scrape out the residual and then obviously give it a good cleaning because you don't want chalk in your smoothies or whatever you use your blender for. So just to show you guys what this liquid chalk looks like when it's applied. Alright. And everyone that, every time I bring my liquid chalk uh, to the gym or like a park training session or something like that. Everyone kind of freaks out that I make my own jock and it's super easy and it's less messy. Like if you try to put on loose chalk, it just kind of goes everywhere. This stuff dries super quick. It stays on your hands a lot better than the loose chalk. So just figured I'd share that with you guys. And I'll link all, uh, all the products in the description below that I used here. Like I was saying, you guys, you can play with the consistency. This chalk is, is good for um, calisthenics, gymnastics, rock climbing, anything that you would use chalk for, weightlifting, uh, CrossFit, if you're into that sort of thing. <laughs> but let me know what you guys think, and hopefully this helps you out. And it's also a heck of a lot cheaper than purchasing the pre-made liquid chalk if you ever uh, just go online and, and price it versus uh, some rub rubbing alcohol and gym chalk, loose gym chalk. And um, you can just compare it and see how much you can save. And this stuff will last you a really long time. And you can put it in small, smaller containers as well. Um, just make sure that they are airtight or else the alcohol will evaporate and it will no longer be liquid chalk. So I have had no issues with this drying up on me. Um, this is like the second batch I've made. Um, the first batch lasts me uh, a long time. This is about half full and it's it's lasted me probably six, six or seven months. So And that's training probably five times 
a week. So give it a shot. Let me know what you guys think.